If you think everything's calmed down on Flamingo Road, well, you're wrong again, Soap Opera Breath, because I had a chance to talk to two of its residents, the lovely Luda May, Stella Stevens, and the evil Fielding Carlisle, Mark Harmon. Luda May, what's up for her? Well, what's up for her is a lover, finally, after all these weeks of celibacy, I think. <laughs> and it's about time. <laughs> because everybody else has been fooling around, and Ludie Mae hasn't had a chance yet. Lonely, lonely hero. Lonely. Lonely Ludie Mae, yes. And Mark, the evil. Gonna try to get more evil, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> Nazca, actually, the Nazca. The uh, evil building. Yeah. More beatings of Morgan Fairchild? Maybe. You know, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> might get lucky. I don't know. <laughs> uh, I think you like that part. I, I don't know. I'm just trying to figure out what Field ha hasn't done already. You know, mm. he... Uh, he's, he's already pushed her down the stairs. Yeah, he has. Yeah. We don't know how Morgan is, really. You know, she was left in a crumpled heap at the bottom of the stairs after he pushed her down. Mm -hmm. So what more can you do, actually? I don't know. <laughs> do people come up to you and ask you, you know, how can you be so mean to her? She's so sweet. You know, so Mike, good. people come up to me, honest to goodness, more than anything, and say, you know, you are living my, my life. They say, you, oh, are, mm -hmm. you are me. And I go, oh, man, oh, no. you got problems. <laughs> <laughs> so it looks like life will be as normal on Flamingo Road again this fall. Everything is going according to plan.